good to see you. Um, we are in a different Dollar Tree than the one I normally take you to. Um, I just happen to be in the area and I need to get some tape. My son likes to make these little 3D things. He'll take pieces of, uh, he'll cut pieces of cardboard and then he will tape them together and he makes these things. I don't know how to describe it, but he makes all different kinds of things. Um, and he uses up all, all the cardboard boxes. It's a good thing I order from Amazon so much because he has lots of cardboard to work with. But he uses up all my tape. Um, and I didn't feel like going to another store. I mean, Dollar Tree is, it's little and it's not quite so crazy to shop in there. So um, I came in here to look for tape. And while I'm in here, I thought we could look at a few other things as well. Because this one... This one is actually bigger than the one I normally go to, and I think they have a better selection of stuff. So, let's see. I'm, I'm actually on the toy aisle right now, and I just spotted this. Um, now, I have never seen these in uh, Dollar Tree before. Now, these are obviously not Lego brand, but you can get these um, building blocks in white, red, red one goes there, yellow, black. And they also have these base plates in yellow, green, blue, gray. That is a great deal. Now, I don't know. I have not tried them, so I don't know if they work as well as the regular ones. I don't know if they work as well as, like, you know, regular Legos. Probably not. But, I mean, for a dollar, you know, that's, that's a pretty good deal. So, and then we have um, things like little plastic uh, look like police officers and a little raft and a helicopter oh these were always so fun when I was a kid the little balsa wood uh, glider you, know, you make this little lightweight uh, plane with the, the wood you know and uh, they have little ninja oh these are wall crawlers I Anybody that was a kid in the 80s probably remembers the wacky wall walkers. I think they had them at Burger King or something. Or no, no, no. I think they were a, a toy and cereal or something. They were just like this. And they have sticky feet and hands. And they just kind of flip over and over and stick to the wall. And they look like they're walking down the wall. <laughs> or crawling or sort of flipping down the wall. Yeah, those things are awesome. And we have the artificial flowers. These are pretty. I like these. Which, of course, they have um, artificial flowers at the other one. But this one, I think they might have a bit more. They have more of a variety. Um, ooh, that one's pretty. They have a pretty good selection here. I mean, they have some up here as well. Pretty spring flowers. It's very nice. Um... Oh, this is cute. It's a little chair pad and it has crabs and stuff on it. I think at the Dollar Tree we were at the other day, we saw some uh, serving plates and stuff that had this pattern on it with the crabs and the turtles and the, the stuff. And this one's pretty too. It's, it's, um, you know, it's a dollar, so it's not going to last you very long, but it's still not bad for a buck. Here's one. That one's pretty. It looks like they don't have many left. They have one of those. Um, yeah, they don't have many, so I think they've been very popular. I've never seen chair pads at Dollar Tree before. Oh, we have wigs, little hair extensions, and all different colors. We have black, blonde, there's some red back there, or orange, it's not really red. Brown, really pretty. And we have pony. <laughs> it's just pony. <laughs> it's like a My Little Pony and it comes with a comb and everything. You have pink ones and purple ones. And you can even get fairy wings and a little skirt. That's cute. And a tiara and a little magic wand. That's adorable. They have them in pink and purple. And princess necklaces. It even it literally says princess necklace. I just bought a beaded curtain at a yard sale for a dollar and it's made out of these beads like this. It's fabulous. As soon as I find a way to set it up where I can make a video with it, I'm totally gonna make a video with the sound of this 
wonderful beaded curtain. I love the dollhouse furniture. Check that out. It looks like a little chest of drawers. And they have a little, like a table. And this little uh, dresser thing. Oh, they have a bed too. And then, okay, I came here for tape. I came here for tape. You can see they have these um, little things of scotch transparent tape. You get two rolls for a dollar. Now there's not a lot on here, um, but it's, it's still not bad for a dollar. Um, you get, let's see, you're gonna get 13.8 yards total out of that. Uh, that'll last my son a week or so. He uses up a lot of this stuff. They also have double-sided tape. Um, I might get him a roll of this too because I think some of the stuff he does uh, double-sided tape would work. And they have envelopes in here. You can get security envelopes. You see they have the long ones like this and then we have the shorter ones here. You can get 40 security envelopes. And you can get the ones with the peel like you don't have to moisten it, you just remove the, the strip here and then it has an adhesive on it. And they have little ones too, they have little, the shorter envelopes too. You can get 40 of those with the peel off thing. And we have play school crayons, which I didn't even know play school still made stuff. Um, but apparently they do, it's Mr. Potato Head. Animal Rescue, little kitty. We have an Adventure Time book. Oh. This is, um, that's cool. I get that for my son. We'll come back and look at these books. This is a very busy Dollar Tree, um, and they love the overhead uh, speaker thing. So I do apologize, uh, but sometimes they get a little crazy with the speaker. Worst person ever. <laughs> what the heck? You can find all kinds of books in here. Um, yeah. Most of them I've never heard of, but yeah. You can get little gift bags. I like these small ones. Ooh, that blue one's really pretty. And they have more toys. I mean, look, we just looked at um, there. I think there are two or three aisles of toys, and then we have all these too. My kids have always loved this Dollar Tree because they have so many things. Oh, this is craft stuff here. So you have little pipe cleaners. These are pretty. These are the regular different color pipe cleaners, and they also have metallic pipe cleaners in green, silver, red, and gold. And you can get sheets of felt. You can get 14 felt sheets for a dollar. That's a good deal. And wood dowels. And look at the feathers. These are pretty too. What's this? Oh, it's a little white. That's a little LED candle. That's pretty. And googly eyes. They have, ooh. All different colors, like if you have a disease or something, you can get these funny colored Google eyes. Google eyes, that reminds me, when I was really small, like a toddler, I insisted to my mom that I was a doogle eye. I still don't know what a doogle eye is, but I told my mother. I went through a spell for about six months where I said I wasn't a person or a girl, I was a doogle eye. I still don't know what the heck that meant, but... Oh, they have wooden beads. They don't have these at the Dollar Tree near me. You know, I bet these would make nice sounds, these wooden beads. And they have plastic ones, too. These are nice. And little jewels. Oh, my. I mean, I can think of so many different videos that I could make. And look at these pretty buttons. These would make nice sounds, too. I don't even know where these came from. I don't know, but they were right there. Oh, and they have these cute little craft storage boxes. Look at that. They have them in purple and pink and blue. Very nice. 
fastener strips. This uh, Velcro. It's like Velcro. You can get a yard of Velcro for a dollar. And you can get little Velcro dots. 20 pairs for a dollar. If you're into crafts and stuff and you have a Dollar Tree near you and you've never checked it out, it might be worth your while to go see if they have stuff that would work for you, like these glitter glue sticks. And they also have liquid adhesive. Actually, I need some of that. I'll have to take that with me. And a window marker. You can get them in all different colors, I suppose. Um, well, it doesn't say what color it is. I guess it's just that color. But I don't see any that are different, so I don't know. Oh, and I do, I do have some of these, too. These are... Well, I have the marbles. These are the little glass gems. I have just like a bag of marbles like this that I want to use eventually. I just haven't gotten around to it yet. It's on my list. I have so many different, I have so many different videos I want to make. And I just, I have some like this right here. These marbles. So many videos I want to make. And I just don't, I just don't have time to get to it, you know? What's that? Ooh, sand. Now oh, that's nice. You can get green sand. You can get a 1.1 pound bag of green sand for a dollar. Oh, they have blue. That's a pretty. It's not really blue. It's kind of like a lavender color. It's not blue, blue. And they have black, white, red seashells if you run out of toilet paper <laughs> if you saw my toilet paper video I still don't know how in the world you use seashells to um, wipe I don't think I want to know that's a beautiful vase look at that thing very pretty they have a nice selection of vases in here look at all these they have these plain straight ones like this and these Pretty, I like the, the pattern on that. That's nice. And one like this. This looks like a hurricane lantern's globe, kind of. And then just the standard, you know, face. Um, oh, look, what's, look, look what I found. I found candles. These are from Luminescence. This is fresh linen. That goes over there. And we have... Apple cinnamon. We have lots of vanilla, it looks like. That one has 12, 18, 17 written on it. I don't know why. But yeah, this, this Dollar Tree is usually pretty crowded. And this Dollar Tree actually stays open later than any other Dollar Tree I have ever seen. It's open until 10 o'clock every night. Which, every other one I know of closes, I think, at 8. So that's kind of weird. Oh, how adorable! It's, oh, it's like a little cupcake. It's lemon poppy scented. That's precious. The top is made of plastic. Oh, we saw these in the other one. The other Dollar Tree we were in. Cute. And then we have uh, oh, a dog grooming mitt. Cool. We have candy. Lots of candy. It's actually not too, not too messy. Snickers minis. Here we have Milky Way Simply Caramel. This has milk chocolate and just a caramel inside it. I'm not sure where this came from. I don't see it anywhere. Alright, so we'll just put it down here in this em empty space. York peppermint patties. That, this is one of my favorite things right here. It's just a like a mint patty with chocolate over it. And these are unwrapped minis. Butterfinger bites are good too. These are wonderful. It's hard to describe what Butterfinger tastes like. 
Um, you'd really have to, you just have to try it. I don't know how to describe it. It does have peanuts in it. Not, I mean, like you don't see the peanuts in there, but they look like that when you, when you break them or bite into them. It's very good. And a bunch of crunch, which is Nestle's crunch. And it's basically um, like Rice Krispies coated in Nestle's chocolate. That's basically it. And Hershey's Kisses with chocolate filled caramel. Once again, we have the Kit Kat white chocolate minis. I don't really like the white chocolate ones. What are these? Let's see. Oh, oh, these are so good. These are the Hershey's Kisses cookies and cream flavor. It's white chocolate with little pieces of chocolate cookie in there. So delicious. Rolo is another one of my favorites. I don't know if you can tell, but I have a real sweet tooth. <laughs> It's chewy caramels and milk chocolate. It's really good. Reese's miniature cups. These are just the plain Reese's. Reese's cups. Yummy. And they have them in white chocolate as well. Um, really the only way I like white chocolate is just by itself. Or uh, white chocolate covered pretzels are good too. But I don't want them on anything else. I don't want white chocolate or anything else, but as you can see, I mean, this, this store actually has a much better selection of just chocolates and stuff like that. Maple nut goodies. This is, I always think of my dad when I see these. This is one of his favorite treats right here. It's front, it's roasted peanuts and crunchy toffee, and it has maple syrup in it. That's one of his favorite. I get him these every year for Christmas. I'll buy him some of those. He loves them. And then we have Russell Stover mint patties. These are in dark chocolate. This is basically the same as a York peppermint patty. And then of course we have the cleaning supplies. Look at these adorable, <laughs> adorable little bottles of fabric softener. Oh my God, that is so cute. This does 12 loads. April Fresh Downy. I don't use fabric softener. I've had bad luck with fabric softener. Um, I've had several occasions where I put it in and it ended up staining my clothes for some reason and I don't mess with it anymore. My kids don't give a crap so I don't worry about it. Here we have, wow that's only a dollar, that's a giant. This is 2-in-1 laundry detergent plus fabric softener from uh, Totally Awesome which they make. Their stuff is surprisingly good, their cleaning products. And then we have Gain liquid laundry detergent which is good. I use uh, Aldi's version of Gain and it works great. That's a lot cheaper. Wool wash, that's like wool light of course. And then we have several, look at all the, look at the variety of dryer, fabric softener dryer sheets. I mean it's, it's impressive. It's really impressive. One cool thing about products like this that I noticed uh, working in a grocery store, I worked in a grocery store uh, for a couple of years in high school, and a lot of times you'll see products like this that will have the, the wording and everything oriented one way on one side and oriented the other way on the other side. So you can display it on the shelf like that or like that, and either one will work. Not every product is that way, but some of them are. See, like this bounces that way. Just a neat thing. I'm gonna bring some of these forward here. Look at that one there. There. And gain. There's some more gains sitting there. They have a startling selection of dryer sheets. <laughs> look at me. Look at all these. Wow. Fabuloso. I have never tried this stuff. I don't know if it's any good or not. Um, I don't think you go up there. You go right there. They have lavender, and it's um, it's just a, an all-purpose cleaner, and you mix it with water depending on you mix in different levels of concentration depending on what you're gonna do with them. I don't want to get them too close to the edge because the edge is kind of dented in a little bit, and I don't want them to fall. And they have, oh, they even have, this is passion, passion fruit, passion of fruits, apples and pears. 
See, a lot of times I don't like to buy stuff that has all these different smells because sometimes it just makes me hungry. <laughs> Which is weird, but okay. Let's see what's on this aisle. I mean, this, this aisle has, I mean, the store has so many things in it. We could be in here for two hours looking at everything. They have these uh, wall creations. Like you can, these are little adhesive things. Oh, this one's precious. Look at the little animals. Oh my God, I love the little, the little fox. That is so cute. But they're just basically, they're just giant stickers. Ooh, I like that fox too. That is so sweet. Um, and these are only a dollar. They have all different kinds. Like you can get some with a rocket ship and a little spaceman and the earth and the sun playing. We better hope they don't ever get that close because we'll all be fried. But it's still cute. And then we have superhero pictures. Oh, that's just one-sided. They even have pirate stuff. Mm -hmm. It's pretty cool. I remember one time seeing a children's book, and I, I cannot remember who wrote it or what it was what it was, but it was a book about encouraging children not to not to take things that don't belong to them. And the main characters in the story were pirates, and I just thought it was kind of funny that pirates were going to lecture me about stealing. <laughs> I don't know. I saw it in a bookstore somewhere. I don't know. It was just funny. Hello, hello dream little probably made out of lead and I'm gonna go insane now from handling it but we have just like the other one we have picture frames now they may look like wood or metal but they're made out of plastic for the most part um yeah that's plastic it looks like wood though and they even have these cool display easels these are great um, and in a lot of stores they have these and then they have little ones too a lot of the a lot of stores you find these things and they're gonna be like ten bucks or more um, but you can get them here for one dollar and I mean who cares nobody's really gonna see it they're gonna be looking at whatever you're displaying anyway so yeah um, oh we here we have the household goods section they have furniture scratch markers. These really come in handy. I have some of these and they really work like a charm. They have them in um, different colors, like a black one, dark brown. And this one, it's kind of hard to tell, but it's almost like a burgundy color. Yeah, it's awesome. And you can get a sandpaper set, a wire brush, all kinds of neat things like little mini scrapers. It's, it's a great place to come and, and find just about anything. Look at that nice selection of foam brushes. Now at a lot of stores, that would be $5, I bet, or more. $1 for those eight brushes. It's awesome. And we've looked at the light bulbs before. You know, not a huge selection, but I mean, it'll take care of the job if you need a light. If you need a light bulb, you're going to find it. Filter mask. Let's see. Oh yeah, we have cleaning products. I think we've we, we looked at these before. Little sponges, Estracel. These are from Billo. Says that more more sanitary. I, I don't like I don't like sponges. I don't I don't use them. I don't trust them. <laughs> I'm always afraid they're infected with some kind of nasty germ, and you know. Kind of fun to handle though. I like the sound. Plastic's a little thin. That one's better. These are just uh, soap dispenser brush replacement heads. What else have we got? Oh, they have a lot of snack stuff in here. Uh, it's probably because this one is really close to a movie theater. Now, of course, I'm not condoning taking in snacks, but I don't think it's a coincidence that right near the movie theater we have a Dollar Tree with all these little convenient-sized snacks. 
Yeah, I don't think it's a coincidence at all. <laughs> my son has got me hooked on these flaming Hot Cheetos. My God, I cannot. I can't have them in the house. I'll, I'll eat the whole bag if I have them in my house. It, yeah, this store is really crowded, so I've tried to stay away from the checkout because it's noisy up here. Um, but I wanted to show you. Look at all that nail polish. But see, I can't organize it because it's it's noisy up here. You have all the beeping from the register, the noise of customers. I mean, it's it's just madness up here. But this is the um, they have makeup up here. Ooh, that's pretty. Look at that rainbow lip gloss. That's awesome. They have cute little compact mirrors. Look at that. Um, oh, and then we have hair products over here. And here we are at the security desk. I hope there's nobody in there because if there is, they think I just waved at them. It's like this. The office is in there and that's a two-way mirror. Look at those interesting ponytail holders. Those are cool. They have little barrettes. Those are precious. And we have, Lord have mercy, banana clips are coming back. I'm ashamed to say I have pictures of me in the 80s sporting banana clips and I thought I was, I thought I was the bomb. Of course we all did. Everybody wore those things back in the 80s. Well, every, all the girls. Ooh, these, these are, I've been looking for some of these, these, um, these just plain old hair clips. I have not been able to find these anywhere. I would like to find some a little bit smaller than that, but I'm taking these home with me. I'm going to have to come back through and grab some of those. And they're only a dollar. That's awesome. And some more elastics. These are pretty colors here. This way. This is a funky brush. Look at that. That's weird. Kind of flat looking. Little short bristles on that thing. Interesting brush. I like this one, all the different colored bristles on it. That's cool. That one goes there. Oh wow, look at all the tissue down there. It's almost completely... God, it's like I work here. You know, I was thinking, if one day I decided to just go with a part-time job, I could just get a job. I would just ask if they would hire me just to come straighten their stores and I could just go around straightening all day. As long as I didn't have to check out customers. <laughs> I don't like doing that. I would I would love to do that. What else have we got? Um, down there is the frozen food and the refrigerated stuff, but it sounds it sounds noisy down there. I don't want to go down there. We have oh that's interesting. I've never seen these. Disposable cleansing washcloths. That would come in handy if you were going camping or something like that. You just use them and toss them. Don't lecture me about it, please. I'm just saying you could, like if you just needed something, for some reason if you needed something like that, it would also be good too to um, like keep these in your diaper bag. Trust me, if you've ever had a baby, you know that sometimes those little diaper wipes ain't cutting it. No, sometimes you about need to call out the fire brigade, it's so bad. And they don't ever have those colossal blowouts at home. Heavens no, they wait until you're right in the middle of the mall. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's when it happens. And it's like you need an exorcist. It's, yeah. Lemon citrus. This one's a little different. You notice the uh, they don't have lemon citrus there and the picture's different. wonder which one is. I, this one is probably older because this one says new. lemon citruses and then they have the foaming hand soap I have some of this in my bathroom downstairs right now it's not this particular kind but it's um gardenia scented I got it at Walmart oh my god it smells so good it is god oh it's the best I love the smell of gardenias anyway it smells just like gardenia blossoms oh my god this crisp cucumber and melon is a good one too I've 
I've used that one before. It's got a nice smell too. And they have oatmeal and verbena soap. That's a big bar of soap. That's 6.2 ounces. Not bad for a buck. And then of course we have, look at, wow. I don't know who straightened all this, but I love them. This, I haven't even touched it and normally this whole section is completely trashed. Look how neat this is. That is beautiful. It's just breathtaking. Like I want to take a picture of that. But I guess I better go get my son's tape. And then I'm going to go grab a couple of other things. I'm going to go get the hair clips too. This is gorgeous. <laughs> this is nice. Oh my God. It's so nice. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go grab a few things. And then I'm going to go home, I guess. And make some dinner. So... Thank you so much for coming and checking out Dollar Tree with me. I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you again soon.